Greetings of the day dear students. Welcome to science class. Today we are beginning with our first biology chapter crop production and management. As you know children, all living organisms need food for their growth and survival. We get our food from both plants and animals. Food is required for the growth and maintenance of the body. It is also needed for the repair of damaged tissues. Plants can make their own food, but animals including us are dependent on plants for their food. Tremendous increase in human population has increased the demand for food production and need for better agricultural activities. In ancient times, man roamed from one place to another and lived on whatever was available in the form of raw fruits and vegetables and by hunting of animals. With time, he started growing crops and domesticated animals. Gradually, he developed tools and tried different practices for better crop production. This led to the evolution of agriculture and different agricultural practices. In this chapter, we will discuss the practices involved in the growing of plants and rearing animals for food. Now let us first understand what do you mean by agriculture. Agriculture is an applied science that deals with the mass production of crop plants and animals useful to human beings. Besides crop production, several other related activities like poultry, fishing and sericulture come within the scope of agriculture. Agriculture can be broadly classified into first horticulture. It is the cultivation of fruits, vegetables and ornamental plants. Second, animal husbandry. Rearing and management of domestic animals is called animal husbandry. We will learn about this later in the chapter. 